one, day one, and the games begin. Hello peeps, welcome to our Pyrenees tour. We do this every year, but this year we're going to do two weeks as we have a couple of extra friends who would like to have a go at this, but most of us have done it all before. This is only open to people we know, friends, no racers, no risk takers. The terrain is totally different to what we're used to in Suffolk, so we head off to this area where we mess around for a best part of an hour to get used to the different surfaces. We're not going to find room to cram all the video in, so we'll just put the highlights in. So this helicopter seems to be practicing fire drill. He picks up some water, does a lap, and then drops it back in the tank again. Not a bad little job, eh? It's a lovely view. Yep. It's just behind you, Paul. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You've got a red dot on the back of your crash helmet. There you go. Call that a drone. This is a drone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So he's having another scoop, Alec. Off he goes. Fair game, I think. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, hang on, I can smell two cheese sandwiches in his mouth. Yeah, as we, we were being really nice to the lady who was telling us off, and because Rosie hasn't got any comms, we were riding out around the track and Rosie's riding over the motocross track and doing the jumps. Could <laughs> he, you know, just to really rub salt in a wound. But yeah. we got away with it, so uh, onward. <laughs> oh, it's a lot better now the sun's out, it's lovely. We're all mates, we're all like-minded. We like a bit of banter. We like to have a bit of a drink in the evening, have a bit of fun. And this is something we do for a laugh. A downhill race with no engines. Oh my god, I can't even... Oh, I'm like... Can I do a running start? All right. We're allowed to be in neutral. You're, you've got to be in neutral, yeah? No engine. If you hear an engine start up, you're, in, you're out. You ready? Are we going? Yeah, we're going. Right. And we got some pushers. <laughs> oh. Here we go. I think he's a bit of a there, Paul. We want the... We're away. Oh, fucking Terry's off like a rocket, look. Why is mine so slow? Yeah, that is that, weight helps. Is that silent exhaust? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. I'm getting his slipstream now. Yeah. Oh, great. Uh, a mile in front of me. Yeah. I chickened out on that bed and scrubbed too much speed up. Oh, we're going down there again in a minute. Oh, a bit. yeah. It's not going to stop. It's going to take a bit of a ride yeah. down here. That's, okay, now that was fun though. <laughs> Anything for a laugh. That was pretty much wrapped up by Graham, closely followed by Alex. So the downhill race was wrapped up by Graham, oh, but he weren't cloud. quite so lucky on this section. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I'm going to need a lift. <laughs> Are you alright Graham? Yeah, I'm alright. Just like... This was the steepest climb, lots of fallen trees, lots of debris to clear up. I made myself a little diversion, dropped off the trail and came back on again, but then again I thought, well, we've got to do this again next week, so let's clear the way for a second week. Stay. Oh. Well done, big guys. Now this is a pretty damn hot day. It's not the ideal weather for soaring trees with all this gear on, but Alex seemed to be keen to have a go. Well done. There was a lot of heavy breathing afterwards though. <laughs> yeah, there's still more trees to go around. Have 
piggyback. <laughs> Teamwork makes a dream work. We all worked together while I just watched and talked a load of bollocks and took pictures. And, well, somebody's got to be in charge. We can repent all our sins, mind you. It's going to be dark soon. <laughs> <laughs> What a beautiful little spot this was. It's been a really nice day. I think the guys have enjoyed themselves. And we're now going to look forward to the evening, maybe have a beer and a meal. Captain's log, week one, day two. Bit of a wet start, but it's starting to dry off. No sign of any Klingons. <laughs> One thing which is normally big in the Pyrenees and that is the dust. So if it's a little bit damp overnight or in the morning, there is no dust. Yeah, not so lucky with the weather today. A little bit of shower early in the morning then it dried up a little bit, but it was cloudy. Oh, this is one of the river crossings. Yeah, we got a river crossing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Both of them, yeah. Uh oh, Graham's took another dive. <laughs> what are you Not doing? <laughs> Time for a little bit of refreshment and then on to the castle. What well, a lovely house is on they? Yeah, imagine buddy living here man. Wow. You ain't got far to go to church on a Sunday, have you? Ah uh, yeah. You know, what are we doing? <laughs> Apparently it's tight. I mean Terry got round there. I should say the remains of a castle. Come on in. Come on in. Hello. Go on in. Go on in. You want me to go? Okay, mate. Okay, mate. One of the good things about all being linked by comms is you can uh, let someone else go in front and forward the instructions. It always looks good for video. See Markham, he won't cut a bush at all because he does it for a living. He wants us to pay him. That's why he can't get near a bush, yeah. <laughs> Fantastic bit of lumberjacking there by Alex and Kev. So today we're heading up towards Black Mountain. We know it's closed, but we just want to see what we can find out about it. And uh, we usually stop off at the Range Rover, jump up and down on it a few times, you know, use bollocks. All good? We've just been down to the barrier for Black Mountain and it's still closed. The guy doesn't really speak a lot of anything really. And he doesn't know when it's going to be reopened so we thought there was a possibility it was just closed because of the mountain bike championships. The horns on that bastard. <laughs> yeah. Lovely.
any falling off to be done, he'd be miles ahead of the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. The trails are endless, but in the national parks you're only allowed seven bikes or four cars, so we respect that. Oh, a load of them. What are you doing up there, old dear? Bless. Old Goody family, eh? Yeah. Oh, hey, well. What's that big white one for head biting you? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bless. Off in a minute. Huh? He's alright. <laughs> Head down. Right. And it's looking pretty damn good today, the weather. And uh, uh -huh. the damn hot. Damn hot. Keep the power on. <laughs> that cleaned it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ah. yeah. How long? How long? Uh, 20 minutes. 20? Yeah, yeah. 20 minutes. Okay. Yeah, yeah. The farmer yeah. asked nicely if we didn't mind waiting 20 minutes to move some cattle. Yeah, sure, no worries. Left, yeah, you do, yeah. Left, yeah. right. left. Hang on then. Hang on. Jump. That is a photograph and a half. Don't move. Let me get my hat. Just go. Time for some refreshments. Hello, old dears. The only girls, you stay down there. Is anybody to move? <laughs> Don't look down. That is why we don't. What an amazing trail. Every time it gets right. us. Hunger up here. Yeah. It's a come away from the edge moment. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. Come away from the edge. Oh my God. <laughs> We've stopped here in the yeah. past, had a coke and some tapas. 
Now, Smuggler's Trail starts way behind us in Allens in Spain, but this is where it really starts to get good. I'll be neutral halfway across. Well, thanks for coming along for the ride. Me and the guys have had a great time. Really has been good. Riding with your mates, you can't beat it. Oh, look, there's last year's stickers still on there. Well, thanks, Kev, Graham, Alex, Tell for coming along. You've been great. Now, as Kev's book of excuses, um, Alex's war stories. Alex's book of war stories. By the old Uncle Albert. Magazine. Thanks for coming along. Ride on. Ride safe.